Walking downtown. We're actually going to Zombie Burger right now. Gonna get some uh, vegan food. They do have a couple vegan offerings there, which we have not checked out to this point. But uh, we're gonna go see what they got and uh, hopefully show some people out there who wouldn't otherwise eat a vegan bird that it's not quite so bad, especially nowadays in 2022. So we just left Zombie Burger and Drink Lab, and it was great, it was amazing. Probably the best french fries I've had in years, which I can't say I eat french fries all the time, but I eat them often enough that that's, that's a really big compliment for that restaurant and that establishment. But Inga had the Undead Glen, which has an impossible, or not impossible, sorry, a Beyond Meat Patty on it. I had the Negan, which had their own house-made vegan patty. Um, which I think was a nut-based patty. It's made from maybe sunflower seeds or something like that. And that came with uh, guacamole and vegan chipotle mayo on it. It was outstanding, outstanding. I got the double stack too, so you can get up to three patties even on the vegan burgers, which is nice. Can't say many places give you that option. So worth going out and exploring all the different places that offer vegan food like that. I know everything there is not vegan. Uh, and certain people that are vegan might not agree with going out to a restaurant that isn't fully vegan. But if you don't, if you don't go there and you don't order that stuff, then perhaps they stop carrying it all together. So to me, it is important. Oh, 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 oh. 